Yeah, so we will be trying the chocolate mocha. I'm going to be trying some of these coffee bites with pumpkin slice and the other one of mocha chocolate. Now, as I was saying, they were from Aldi's. $1.50 a bag, which is, you know, cool. I have not seen these before. I have not seen them anywhere for that matter here in West New York. Let me know in the comments if you have seen them. So apparently there are granola mixed with coffee, which is pretty cool because I like granola. I don't eat as much as I should granola-wise. Let's open the bag and see what we got. Hello, hope you are enjoying your day, afternoon, and your evening. We are on our lovely third walk from the sun on the earth. Thanks for watching. Today is another I try. And today I'll be trying something that I bought from Ollie's on Niagara Falls Boulevard here in Niagara County on Niagara Falls Boulevard in Niagara Falls. So if you haven't gotten out that way, that's a, another reason to get out to the falls because of Ollie's and all their amazing deals. I go to the gym. Why am I having trouble? There we go. Don't expect these to be too, too big. They're snack size, bite size. But you can definitely smell the chocolate. And the coffee. Alright, I'm going to show you the inside. Big bag, right? Good size? Let me open it up and just show you. A big size bag with not so many pieces. I'd say around 10. 10 to 13, 10 to 15 maybe, if that, but that is what they look like. Look how much air is in this bag. I don't like it, but that's consumerism. Now back to me. So, this is what they actually look like outside the bag. I'm actually going to count and see how many. So we have one. Two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Hey! I wasn't that off. Uh, twelve, thirteen. Here's what the bites look like outside the bag. At 2.4 ounces, there should be about 25 of them. They look quite interesting but you can say for yourself in the comments what they actually look like i know what i'm thinking what they actually look like i hope they don't it's like it but yeah that's this isn't that's it's not good a dollar fifty for a 13. yeah i don't know it seems like a waste of money but you don't know until you buy it either so you know not to buy it for the price. Let's go flip it around again and see if it's worth buying for the taste. So I just finished one. You know what I can say is, eh. It's pretty much, eh. Let's see if they're just before May fifteenth, twenty twenty four. They're chewier than I thought they would be. They're truer than I thought they would be. I don't know why I thought they'd be crunchy granola. The flavor is interesting. I didn't taste much mocha. The coffee flavor was there. The energy boost was there. I like that part of it. I'm going to go ahead and eat another one. So this is bite number two.
that bite had the mocha after effect. I didn't taste it as much while chewing it. Would I buy them again? Probably not considering how much air was in the bag, number one. And number two, how much you get per bag on top of that. You taste the granola first, the coffee second, and the mocha last. I would want more the chocolate and coffee than granola. But, given it is a granola snack, I understand where it's coming from. I don't know if I like them or not. I don't like them for the price, and I don't like them for how much you get for the price. If I were to buy these again, probably not. No. Uh, if they were on sale again, okay. Uh, I would definitely not pay full price for these. I guess I would just say, I don't like them. I don't like them, I don't like them, I don't like them. And mostly it's because there's not much coffee flavor, there's not much mocha flavor. That's pretty much it. Well, I'm going to go eat some more of these. Because they do bring in, they have an energy boost in them according to the bag. So, that's a plus. Let me know in the comments if you've tried these. And also... Let me know what you think overall. But to me, they're not worth it. I don't like them. I've had better granola stuff, and these aren't the top of the granola. Top of the granola bubble is what I usually get. So that's my thoughts on Coffee Bites that you can pick up at... Ollie's on Niagara Falls Boulevard. I don't know how long they're going to have them. I don't know if they're out. I don't know when they're getting them back. So get to Ollie's ASAP because they could be gone by the time, you know, it's theirs. Or you get there. Regardless, go to Ollie's and Niagara Falls Boulevard because they have a lot of good stuff. They also have redone their store. And it's going pretty well. They still have the floors to do. I don't know why I'm giving you that update. But having said all that, right of this, hope you enjoy the rest of your day, afternoon, and your evening, wherever you are on our lovely third rock from the sun, planet Earth. I'm Dave. This is my life. And I thank you for watching. The, you get the coffee flavor. Try that again. The flavoring is not there. I taste more granola than anything else, which is, you know, fine. That part's okay. The mocha was an after effect. The coffee. I'm going to do it this way. I'm going to try that again. I'm going to do it this way. And they re renovated. Try that again.